live with you guys out on the waters of Beaufort, South Carolina. We're out trawling in our new to us shrimp trawl boat today, guys. Um, we've been, we've had the boat for about three or four weeks, but we're constantly battling issues. And I've been asking people, do you know what boat stands for? Break out another thousand, right? But we worked out most of the issues so far and we've already deployed our 42 foot trawl net behind this 25 20 parker and we're lucky that we're in an enclosed area here today in south carolina because it's about 50 degrees here and give them a little panoramic view of uh, the area around us and a beautiful look through the windows of this boat with you guys. We'll give you a little walk around, gonna walk around the outside of the boat with you guys, just get to, let you get a little bit better look. We're happy, staff and I are super excited to have this new vessel. You know, little V-berth down here, underneath here, with storage, all types of stuff that we may need while we're out here. Even some little cabinets and drawers that we filled up with tools and different things that we may need out on the waters while we're shrimp trawling. So if anything comes up with the vessel, we'll be able to, you know, work on it. This is a 1988 Parker Pilot House. We are right out in front of the Harbor River. We're in the Harbor River right out in front of Harbor Island here, guys. You can see some of the houses off in the distance. And you can see the, the this boat, it has uh, some rigging on it, but we're going to still have to work on some more things, getting it together, putting it all together to make it like we want. We do have this electric winch right now, which is not a lot for a trawl boat, but it's going to help us out. Just like I was saying, we already have the net deployed out of the back. We're dragging along a 42 foot trawl net. Couple coolers, full of ice. A little look around the front of this vessel. Got a couple handrails here to hold on to as you're moving around to the front. Got an anchor sitting on the deck that I need to put back in the bracket real quick with you guys. Light bar on the front. You guys may be able to see Steph. She's in there. She's driving us along, guys. She's helping me out. Teamwork makes the dream work, right? We pray, keep bringing you guys along on these shrunk taller videos. And we're thankful for each and every one of you that have decided to subscribe to our channel and we're gonna keep trying to make these videos guys no matter what it is if we're out on the waters fishing with our family or if we surf trawling or if we just walk in the beach here in South Carolina we're gonna to try to bring you guys along just like we did in the past over 10,000 subscribers now and we're super excited about it guys there will be a video coming out from this day to show you what we catch today so i hope you guys definitely go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that when that video comes up each and every one of you can see what we catch in this 42 foot trawl net today thank you guys so much for coming along with us on our videos back in here with steph we'll get a few words from her And guys, look right here. Here we go. We're pulling in 14.6 foot of water right now. And you can see right here a little bit, guys. We're moving at 2.6 mile an hour. So when you're trawling, that's about the perfect speed. I mean, you want to be about 2.2 to 2.4 to 6 miles per hour. Right now, we're coming in uh, to the Harbor River Bridge area. Uh, with the tide. The tide is coming in 
So that, therefore, that's why you see them, we're pulling about three miles per hour. The tide is kind of helping us move in. Um, as we spin around, you know, we'll, we'll drop down to about, you know, two mile an hour. And we're trolling along with this motor. It's a gasoline powered engine back here in this cover, guys, with uh, the shrimp pole box right on the top. And we're pulling along with this 5.7 liter Merc Cruiser at 1800 RPMs. 1800 RPMs. We still hadn't estimated how much fuel this big baby is going to burn and even if it's going to be worth it. I'm kind of uh, scared right now because I know we need some big pulls and we're, guys, we're just hoping for the best. You know, we, we started with this small boat and got into shrimp trawling and just fell in love with it. And now, you know, we get to come out here in this boat. I know this thing isn't, you know, that glamorous or anything, but it makes for the wonderful, wonderful, you know, trawl boat for us. We're super excited about it, right stuff. We are. I see that big old smile you got with them big pretty teeth. Thanks. It's cold out there. It I'm is cold out there. Good to have this cabin. And my goal also, guys, I keep saying it and I keep telling stuff, you know, one of the reasons why that I wanted this boat is because me, I'm out on the water with stuff. I'm, I'm, I've got to be kind of like the captain, or I am the captain, right? And the worst thing that I could do is bring somebody, a crew member, somebody aboard this boat, even if it's just stuff, and get her hurt. I do not want to do that. That is not the type of person I am. I would rather, you know, come out here and go home without anything on this boat and just waste a day because I just love being out here anyhow. You all guys that, you know, you real commercial shrimp trawlers and that's what we've become also actually is we're commercial shrimp trawling guys. You do need a license to do this right here in South Carolina and you also need a little captain's license. So it's a trawl license, a captain's license. And the third thing that if you're gonna catch enough shrimp, and I'm assuming that if you would try this and you know you got into shrimp and you were you would definitely want to be selling your catch. So that is a another license actually. Wholesale license. Wholesale license. So three licenses to come out here and do this type of stuff. And then you know you got to buy the vessel the fuel and all that so guys you know it's a struggle but when you love something enough you just gonna got to stick with it and try to keep on moving along how many of you guys out there just would love to be out on this boat with us today give us a little thumbs up if you'd love to be out here on this boat guys I see you watching all you guys watching we got the dolphin they're following us remember guys go ahead hit that subscribe button I'm gonna get off here with you guys there's a new video coming on out soon as soon as I can get it on I'm gonna put it out there with you guys I'm gonna show you what we call this trawl net today thank you so much guys I really appreciate each and every one of you over 10,000 subscribers that's a big deal for this uh, young boy or old boy right here in uh, South Carolina. Thank you so much.